What's going on you guys, it's your boy Lloyd here and I got a question from a viewer um, and he basically writes, hey Lloyd, how do I get a girl to miss me? Uh, so the situation probably for this guy is that he was having a great thing with a girl for a little bit um, and then suddenly she's maybe not texting him quite as much, she's taking slower and slower to respond or she might be in the process of ghosting him. Okay, so what can you do when you're in this position to try and get the girl to miss you? Now I see a lot of information on the internet um, about this sort of stuff and it's kind of in the right direction but I think there's a bigger part to this. So I'm going to tell you how to get this girl to miss you, what things to do. Um, but actually, uh, stay to the end because I'm going to tell you what you really should do in these situations. Um, these can help, but it won't, won't ultimately solve the problem. Okay, so uh, to get a girl to miss you, typically this girl, you know, if you spent a lot of time with her or if it, you went too quick to, um, you, you went too intense to too fast with her, then that can scare people off as well too. Um, a lot of times this will happen with a girl where you think it's going great and, you know, she just, out of nowhere, maybe she changes or something like that. Okay, so how do you get her back? How do you get her to, to want to miss you? Well, I would say the first thing is don't introduce negativity. Don't be trying to beg her to come back or do any of that sort of stuff. I don't know if anybody's thinking about doing this watching this video, but just in case you are, <laughs> don't do that. Okay, uh, and the other thing that I would recommend that you do too is focus on yourself. Okay, that's the biggest thing. Now, obviously, the best way to get a girl to miss you is to get another girl that's better than her, and then she sees that, and she's like, oh, I messed up, I had a great guy, blah, blah. You know, that would be the thing to do, but probably if you're in that situation right now, um, that's not gonna happen for you. You probably met a girl that was, like, really, really good, and it's tough to get another girl like her. Um, so what I would recommend that you do is, like I said, focus on yourself, do things that are gonna entertain your life, do things that are gonna make your life better, okay? Put yourself first, like I always say on this channel. And once you start doing these sorts of things, you start uh, maybe going out and doing cool shit, like maybe you went, um, you know, uh, maybe you went to like a, an event or something like that. Maybe you started spending more time with your friends. Maybe you started improving certain other areas of your life, doing cool hobbies, okay? Um, you know, those sorts of things. Maybe you went paragliding, I don't know, okay? Now, if you put that stuff on like social media or if you kind of demonstrate that and she hears about it from other people, then she's probably going to want to, you know, want to go out with you again because she realizes, oh, you know, I had a good thing. And sometimes when you drop everything to, to be with a girl and she feels that, she feels like there's something wrong with you or she feels like your life must not be that cool that you're going to drop with her. Now, this is not happening at a conscious level. It's kind of happening at an unconscious level. That's what women uh, have kind of... It, it, it's biology, basically. Like that's that's what she's feeling. If that's happening to you, then yeah, I would recommend that you put yourself first and start doing all those stuff, and she'll kind of hear about it, and she'll see what a you know what a great life you're having, um, and then she'll want you back because of that. Um, now, here's the thing about this: once you do this, and the best example that I can think of was I had a lot of girls where. I left and we had something and maybe they stopped texting me or whatever and this happened when I was around like 25 and I, no sorry, 23. Then I went and I traveled for like, um, I don't know, a year and then I came back and when I came back, so many of these girls were reaching out to me and they're like, wow, like you've, you seem like you've changed, you know, like all those sorts of things. So they would reach out to me and I could tell they wanted to get back with me. Um, or that they at least wanted to, at first, when she reaches back out to you, she's going to be like curious. She's going to see if you're actually the changed man that she sees, or if you're just going to be the same guy that's doing the same old thing. So if that's the case, then um, basically just stick to your guns. Don't immediately drop everything and then try and get with her again. Because if she reaches back out to you, chances are she's testing the waters. So like, just if she says, hey, how's it going? Or hey, I saw your pictures. They look pretty fun. You know, just be like, yeah, that was cool. It was cool. How are you doing? And then, you know, she says something and then don't say anything after that. That would be a great way of doing things, okay? Then that's going to make her want you more. So when she comes back in, don't immediately drop everything and go with her and continue being that person. You have to show her that you've changed. And then when you show her that you've changed, then chances are she's going to be more likely to, to come back to you. Okay, so that is the way to get a girl to miss you. If she sees you doing cool shit, having a great life without her, she's going to miss that. She's going to miss those things. She's going to think, oh, maybe I was being too judgmental or you know, I don't know why I got so crazy or too scared. And then she's going to want you back. Unfortunately, though, um, I would say it's probably still not a good idea to get back with her. Look, man, if, if a girl left you that easily one time, 
who's to say she's not going to do it again? Um, yeah, sure. I, I believe that certain people, that the right people can meet at the wrong time. That's true. But she has to change a little bit too. What do I mean by this? Okay, if a woman meets a great guy and then she gets scared and runs away from it, like that's also a sign of her immaturity too. It's not just you. So have standards for yourself as well. If a girl does this to you and she wants you back, don't immediately try and get her back. And don't think just because she leaves you, oh, I did something wrong and I have to get her back. You might not have, like... I would not recommend getting going in too quickly with a girl, um, but there's a chance that you might not have done as much wrong as you think you did. So if she tries to get back with you, you know, show her that you changed, but there should be some indications that you can trust her because who's to say she's going to leave you again? Who's to say she's going to, you know, drop you for some unknown reason? You don't know that. And so having standards for yourself and making sure that the women that you bring in your life don't do those kinds of things will prevent this. But the problem is, is that when a guy loses something, he really wants to get it back and he, he doesn't really think about what's best for him in that moment because emotionally you just, you miss this person and so you want them back in your life. So if that happens, you guys, what I would recommend that you do is, you know, check to see if she's changed. If like, I get girls that hit me up all the time that maybe when I first started going out, like, I wasn't very good at talking to them or expressing myself or being that kind of attractive guy, and they reach back out to me, but a lot of times I don't even respond to them, or I don't even, you know, maybe we'll respond and we'll talk for a little bit and maybe hook up, but I'm not interested in pursuing anything further, or I'm not, I don't really keep up with them, because I know these women haven't changed. I know they're not, um, I know they're the same person that I hooked up with years ago, and we're going to have problems down the line. I've you know, <laughs> I've been dating a while, so I, I, I know this kind of stuff goes down. So that's would be my recommendation for you guys. Look, you can get a girl to miss you. That's fine. But in the end, you have to really ask yourself, is this going to be the best thing for my life? And chances are it might be best to kind of leave it as it is. And unless she's changed, I, I, I don't even think you should try and get her to miss you. So that's my advice for you. Uh, if you made it to then consider subscribing. I come out with videos like this every single week. Thanks a lot, you guys. Good luck out there.